This J6 defendant was not only found guilty, the judge ordered that they not spend the money in their Give, Send, Go account. But it's not really their Give, Send, Go account, it's being run by their wife to benefit him and his family, but she's also not really his wife. It is quite a weird situation. Now some backstory, if you haven't followed J6 cases, is that previously the government has attempted to get fines equal to the amount of Give, Send, Go accounts against J6ers, and the fact that the judge is ordering the money not to be spent makes it seem to me at least that he is considering that in this case. But the Give, Send, Go is being run by this J6 defendant's wife, but they're not married. It's a common law marriage, but they live in Virginia where common law marriage is not recognized. But the money on the account says it's for him and his family. So the argument by the defense here essentially boils down to, it is not him running the Give, Send, Go account. He is not married or related to the person who's running the account. Therefore, he can't be held responsible. Now, will this work with the judge? I don't know. But there is an issue. Let's say that this order ends. If the judge then at sentencing finds him equal to the give, send, go amount, they still need the money. 